waiting for the new Southern heavyweight champion, Bill Dundee. Here he comes. Congratulations, Billy. Uh, there's a lot of comments before the match. There's a lot of comments during it and a lot of comments since the uh, bout. I say it was a good tough one. Uh, you did what you set out to do. You took the title away from Taylor. That's right, Lancer. I come out here and I told all the people that when I wrestled Terry Taylor, he was a paper champion and I would be the Southern heavyweight champion. Now, I'm going to be the Southern heavyweight champion until a better wrestler than me comes along and beats me. But I don't see none around here. There isn't a wrestler around here that can beat Bill Superstar down deep. Now, let me give you another episode in the life of Terrence Weirden Taylor III. Now, he went to college. Now, like I keep telling you, college education is all very good if you're going to be a doctor or a professor or somebody that needs a college education. I left school when I was 14 years old, been on my own since then. Now, everything I got, I clawed, fought, bit, and got it all by my little old self. I didn't have a daddy who was a doctor. Now, he goes to college for a bunch of years, spent $10,000 of his little old daddy's money. Then he gets into the wrestling school in the college, and he wins a couple of wrestling matches, amateur style. So then he goes home, he says, Daddy, I don't need this college education. I'm going to be a wrestler. So he goes all around the country and he gets booked as a professional wrestler. He left the boys and he got in with the men. So then he comes to Memphis, Tennessee, and he teams up with Bill Dundee. What a successful tag team I was, because I won all the matches. Now, he goes to Eddie Moore and he says, I'm so good now, I want a Southern title match. So they book him in a Southern title match. And you know, when he won the belt, he was more surprised than Sabu was. Terry Taylor standing like this in the middle of the ring, and the referee says, here, it belongs to you. You're the Southern heavyweight champion. I won! So they gave you the belt. Then he never defended it. So then Eddie Marlin teams him back up with Bill Dundee, and again, I was a successful tag team, and he's walking around with his belt, telling everybody he's the Southern heavyweight champion. So kind of irked me. So I went to old Eddie. I said, hey, Bugs Bunny, I want a title match with that paper champion. And the first time you give it to me, I'm going to beat him. So I wrestled him. Did I wrestle him when... You did, in fact. Did nothing but wrestle. So your little college education, your little amateur background, didn't do nothing when you got up into the major leagues. You're a minor league wrestler, Terry. Now, you're a good wrestler, brother, and five or six years down the pike, you may be another good southern heavyweight champion. But I'm going to tell you something, brother. This week, I gave you a wrestling lesson last week, and I'm going to make you a promise, brother. This week... I'm going to beat your brains out. I'm going to see how big and bad you are. I never laid a hand on you last week, brother. I just wrestled you. Now, if you're clumsy and whatever you want to say that and it was a mistake, I really don't care because I've got this belt. That makes me the champion. But this week, brother... Now, I'll tell you what, Lancer. I'll save you a lot more embarrassing, Terry. If you come out here, shake hands with me now. We'll call it off. We'll both have a night off. And you just tell all the people the superstar's right. He's a better man than me. I'll just... We'll forget it. But if you don't, brother, and you show up down there this week, I'm going to beat your brains out, Terry, and I'm not going to stop till you crawl over there and you tell the referee, please, please, Mr. Referee, tell Mr. Dundee not to hit me no more because I'm going to beat you, brother. Okay, Billy, I can only say I think that you're letting a little irritation because maybe you were bypassed a couple of times get in the way of it. We didn't deny you're a dynamite wrestler and... You are the champion. I think that you've taken it a little to heart that some just, of the fans like Terry. And I'm and just going to tell you all this. Anybody that wants to crack this belt, anybody in the whole wide world, you just get in touch with Eddie Marlin and the superstar will wrestle you because I'm a great wrestler. Okay, well, you're going to have to beat him again before it's all over with. That's Bill Dundee, and we got action in the ring with Bill and Ball. Let's go today.